hello guys so this is the email which got generated when i try to you know uh, send from the uh, java okay with the help of send grid you could see here via send grid is also there right so what are the steps all those details we are going to learn okay before uh, start doing it you need to generate a api key how you can generate go to email api and then here integration steps then you select the language in my case i have selected java then here you can create this this we have learned in our previous video okay in order to send emails with the help of send grid okay there were a couple of steps that we are going to see this send grid is useful to send bulk emails right but now as of now for you know for learning purpose let's send one email okay so what are the steps is first generate a key and add it to the project i hope you guys have already generated if not i'll suggest you guys to generate it it's free of cost okay now add it to the project simply go to application properties add that key with some name i have given with name called key and try to get that value here okay later we will use that okay then other things are like uh, in order to send email from the java code what are the details you need you need to have like you know what is your address from which address you want to send to whom to other people address right to other people address and also if you see here if you see here uh like from my address i have sent it to this address right so this address as well i need from and to address and also the you know uh subject and other details okay that we will see here okay so simply what we can do is let's go here and create a public void send email as of now let's keep it like this okay so what we have discussed is email object right so let's get that email is nothing but let me keep it as from email okay from email is equal to new email here from email dot you could see set name set email we have okay and this is from from and also to also we need to develop right so that means if i keep it here it will become a duplicated code so for that purpose let me create a reusable method in the down okay so private email set email okay so i have string name and a string uh, email address here i can use email nothing but email is equal to new email of email dot set email is nothing but email address from the parameters and email dot set name is nothing but the name we are going to send okay so i will have from email is nothing but set email okay name and address okay so from address and from name i need it but what how do i need to send this okay so for that purpose let's create a pojo and uh, from input we'll try to you know send that okay so let me keep it as model object here oh sorry let me delete this let me create a package called model okay here uh, let me keep something a class called uh, you know uh, email details okay so inside this email details uh, what we can do is let's have one more class called uh, let's say like uh, email info okay so in email info i will have string name then string email address here 
since i am already having uh lamb work so i can use directly this lamb work annotations right so i have email info so this email info let me keep it here email info as from address then email info of same to address so i can have from address and to address separately and also i can have string something like subject i can have and a string something called uh, you know um, like what you call that email body okay these two i have set properly right so i can keep this all of them as private okay now i am going to use at the way data in order to use that uh, uh, setters and getters and also i am going to add alloc constructor okay this is going to be my this will be going to my input okay so simply do one thing here as part of send email let's keep it as email details okay so here i will have email details nothing but uh, email details dot get now what i can do is let me input this first this is related to from but so get from address from here get name this is one and similarly i can do two as well right so just for easy convenience what i can do is email details dot get uh, from address that is nothing but email info right so email info is nothing but from info i'll keep okay now this from info dot get name i have so i can pass it here and from info then i can do get email address i can pass that okay then similarly i need to set for uh, from and to as well right so let me use something like this from email to to email okay and here email info is nothing but to info info is equal to email details dot get to address get to address right yeah so this object will have to address name and to address email address as well okay so from my to are done now what i need to do is if you see here from and to are done next one is email object right so mail object sorry mail is nothing but mail is equal to new mail okay of here if you see here inside this you need to have from email then you need to have the subject okay if you see here it is suggesting right suggesting like from subject to and email contains right so how do i get the subject subject is nothing but this guy only right so simply use email details dot get subject okay then i have two address so two email next i have the content object okay that i don't have so let me create that content object here content is nothing but this one okay this entire thing is nothing but the content okay this is nothing but subject okay so content is equal to content is equal to new content of new content of this is going to be text plain text 
and what is the content content you can get it from here email body itself right so use like email details dot get email body and you can pass it on here and i will do that to the email you know mail object okay now my mail is done then what i need to do i need to start my sending grid uh, uh you know invocation right so send a grid because we need to send emails right so something like grid is equal to new send a grid of if you see here new send a grid of here it is asking for this asking for you know uh, there were a couple of uh, 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 things are there this is a single parameter this is nothing but the string is nothing but our key okay key is which we have generated and kept it here okay in from the application properties okay so that is a key here okay then now what i need to do is grid dot api okay this is how you can send a email okay so this is nothing but my response but in order to send this okay i need to have request object here see it is suggesting for the request right so let's form that request object as well request is nothing but new request okay then request dot what is the method the method is post method because this should be secret it should if i use get the details will be visible okay set end point is nothing but mail slash send this is send a grid itself is offering okay i'm not doing anything different here okay then set uh, body this body is nothing but mail from the mail i have it so mail dot build okay so this will build but here i need to add exception to the method signature like i were exception okay this is nothing but my request object which i am passing to my send grid so that i will get the response okay now response this is nothing but my response object okay so simply use something like response dot get body is returning me the string so let me return that back here string okay so what are the things we have learned here is we simply add it see we have added the key to the application properties and getting here then we are building the email object of from and to and mail right so from email and to email then email we have built then we have built the body and we have built the uh, subject line and that we are sending over here in order to test it i need to add it this to the controller right so i have already created a controller to save some time okay so this is my controller here and here i have already auto wired my service method as well so simply need to hook that method here this is nothing but email details right so here it will ask for request body request body is nothing but my email details let's say email details okay this i am passing to uh, the details okay and uh, add exception and string that's all okay okay before start using this i need to build this email uh, details right so simply what we can do is let's delete this and let me try to build this okay from address inside from address what i have is name and email address right so name let me keep name as karthik 
and uh, email address as let's say uh, from Gautam Karthik 534 at the gmail.com okay this is nothing but my email my firm address right we will verify them not a big deal okay i was simply preparing the uh you know uh, skeleton here to address as well similarly to address his name is let's say kb and email address is okay then subject and email body right so let me keep subject as hello send a grid okay and email body as well in the meantime let's run this application Spring Boot iPhone colon run right. So here um, email details email body okay. So email body is nothing but this is to test from Java code. Okay, I am good to go here. In the meantime, I hope this is starts running okay some missing return statements okay response return this and 45 as well Acha. okay return email okay now let me rerun this in the meantime this is nothing but my endpoint and uh, here uh, where is my json this is my json this is the postman okay that's okay okay yeah cool this is my json beautify this okay then I think my JSON is also ready and there is something what is that okay already is in use okay already is in use it seems okay not a big deal let me keep this to 9013 and let's rerun this application So let me change this to 9013. I hope you guys have understood the steps, right? This is pretty straightforward if you go with a flow, okay? This is a flow, okay? If you understand contextually, it's pretty straightforward, guys, okay? That's what I'm trying to explain it here. And the application is up. So let me hit here. Now uh okay subject required okay i think this is some error we got subject is required you can get error on the requirements okay okay they are saying subject is required i have formed the subject right let's see okay so email uh, get subject email details get subject and here email details get subject okay 
this is nothing but okay 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 i think that json is little different i believe here yeah, this is where the issue is okay now if i click on send you could see you got 200 let's see here now you could see we got them properly right yeah this is a small demo guys i hope it's informative